The Premier League is not ready for this team next season. I mean, just look at it. Can you see a weakness in this team? Because I can't. How are people honestly doubting this signing? 85 million, yes, it's an awful lot of money. But let me just remind you of something. When Jurgen Klopp spends big, it's always a success. Manchester United have finally found their level. A pre-season friendly against Liverpool's under 18. Get in there, get in! Liverpool 3, Manchester City 1, the first trophy of the season. But anyway, I've been saying it for weeks now, Liverpool are going to be a force this season and this is just the start. Come on the Reds! What the fuck was that? What the actual fuck was that performance? What have I just watched? What the fuck have I just watched? Darwin Nunes, you should be ashamed of yourself. I am a little bit worried about this team. Thank God we have Manchester United next week. Call the season off. Call the fucking season off. We finally won a game. Get in there. Massive win. How do you drop points to them? How the fuck do you drop points to them? Get rid of all of them. I'm not even fucking joking. Get rid of all of them. The season starts tonight. We are a joke. We are an absolute fucking joke. As expected, that was absolutely piss easy. I mean, it's Rangers. Of course it was going. How do these people have a job? I genuinely feel emotional after watching that. Because today we've seen the real Liverpool. How do we go from the performance against Manchester City to one week later produce that? Whatever I have said about Liverpool winning the Premier League, we have as good a chance as anybody of winning the Champions League. What can I say that has not already been said? Because this Liverpool team has officially fucking broken me. I really wish we could play Champions League games every week. I told you all, I fucking told you all. Could Liverpool still win the Premier League? Because for me, the standard is still Manchester City, regardless of who is top. And Liverpool, with 14 games played, are only 10 points behind Manchester City. Club football is back, so I am going to give you my updated predictions for who is going to win these trophies this season. Carabao Cup, I think this is between City and Liverpool because they both easily have the best depth. And I'm going to say Liverpool. I think we beat City tomorrow. Liverpool are out of the Carabao Cup. Do I care? No. No, I don't. Because who cares about the Carabao Cup? Yes! Get in! What a performance from Liverpool. The only negative being we should have scored more goals. <clears throat> Darwin Nunes. But apart from that, I said a few days ago, we're going to see the real Liverpool in 2023. And today is the start. Come on, the Reds! This team just makes me sad. Oh, piss off. Just fucking piss off. Get every single one of them out because I don't fucking care anymore. What is happening to this football club? Because I fail to believe that we are this shit. None of these players look like they care anymore. None of these players deserve to wear that Liverpool badge. None of these players are playing for the supporters or the manager. It is an absolute disgrace and they should be forced to walk home to Liverpool from Brighton tonight. I haven't been this embarrassed of a Liverpool team since Roy Hodgson managed this club. Something has to change and and fucking quick. This team just have to be taking the absolute fucking piss at this stage. I feel like crying. This team is one of the worst Liverpool teams I have ever fucking seen. Oh my god. Oh my god. What a performance. Keep doubting us. Keep fucking doubting us. I am so fucking sick of this shit. And finally, Champions League, I've maintained this all season. Liverpool will win number seven in Istanbul. Oh my god.